What's up, guys? Danny back for another video, and today I'm doing a presentation on the U.S. Air Force. Okay, so if you did not get anything that I just said, basically what we're doing is doing a presentation on the U.S. Air Force. So yeah, let's get to it. What is the U.S. Air Force, you may be asking yourself? Well, I'll answer that for you. The U.S. Air Force is the Aerial Warfare Service branch of the United States Armed Forces. Pretty cool. It means that they have the jets. They go fast. Or like that. Okay, history and origins. The U.S. Air Force was created in 1903. The U.S. Air Force became a separate military branch on 18th of September in 1947. The U.S. Air Force was established to create a separate and equal element to the military. So yeah, pretty cool, right? Important dates and battles. December 7th, 1941, Japan was bombing Pearl Harbor. It ended with the U.S. dropping. Two, not one, not three, not four, but two atomic bombs on, the, on Japanese cities. Almost four years later, that was during, uh, and that, and the, whoa, whoa, sorry, and that was during World War II. So, yeah, and also down here you can check out a photo. Well, actually, technically, it wouldn't be right up here. See? Okay, then. Famous planes. The Lockheed A-12 was uh, an aircraft built for United States Central Intelligence Agency, CIA. Wow. I actually never knew that until I did the research on this. See what you learn all the time? By Lockheed's the Skunk Works. Based on the design of Clarence Kelly Johnson. Hopefully I said that correctly. The Lockheed SR-71 Blackbird slash Blackhawk. Those are two names that it's uh, mainly common for. The Blackhawk is a long-range Mach 3. Sorry. Strategic uh, aircraft, right? That was uh, operated by the United States and it was operated by the United States Air Force. It was developed as a black project from the Lockheed A-12. So yeah, the picture, the jet that we were just now talking about. So yeah, and uh, Lockheed uh, and its gunk work stupid to where it was. Oh, yeah, and cool fact, my grandpa actually got to see the SR-71 Blackhawk uh, while he was in the Air Force. And at the time when he saw it, it was top secret. They were basically like, hey, yo, you want to go see this uh, uh, top secret plane? And they were like, yeah. Don't know what I did there. But yeah, they were like, yeah, of course we do. Like, who does want to see a secret plane, right? So yeah, let's get it on to it. Inventions and technology. The U.S. Air Force invented satellite navigation. Now, if you don't know what that is, basically GPSing systems, right? Nav navigates satellites and stuff like that. I'm pretty sure I said that correctly. But yeah. And the picture of the U.S. Air Force that I have up here. A legendary hero. George Everett Bud Day. George Everett Day. Bud. Bud Day? Buddy? Is he Buddy though? Okay, then. Though he retired the, an Air Force colonel. Today he started his military career as an enlisted marine, joining in 
1947 at age 17. Yo, that's the age that I am right now, even though I'll be 18 next week, March 5th. That is crazy. Age 17. Y'all believe that? I can barely believe that. But of course, I do believe it because of the time of it. But that's besides the point. That is insane. Okay, sorry for going on and on. He learned... He, wait. He uh, was in Air Force during uh, the Korean War. He joined the Air National Guard and was activated in the next year. He flew combat... Uh, In combat and stuff. Yeah, a year later. Okay, so if any of you want to go ahead and read all of this, if you can, like right now it's kind of hard, it's hard for me to read it because of the background. Not sure if any of you can actually read it or not, but if you can, go ahead and uh, pause the video here if you want to read it. Okay, then, next. Important people. Now, these people are important to me and my family. I have two people in my family that have served in the U.S. Air Force. They are my grandpa and my uncle. My grandpa, Roger Neth, joined May 29, 1965 and left November 27, 1968. Now, my grandpa is this guy right here, circling him, as you can see. That's him down there, and he's also over here. That's him in Korea, and story about that. Uh, this little girl here that he's holding, he wanted to adopt her, but he was too afraid to ask my grandma if uh, he can adopt her. So, ended up in a adopt, adop adopting her. Well, sorry for stuttering. But if he ended up adopting her, I could have ended up with Three aunts. Like, right now, my dad is the oldest of the three siblings. If my grandpa would have adopted her, she wouldn't have been older than my dad. Pretty cool, right? And then this is medal that my grandpa earned for serving in Korea. Okay, then. Get on, to, on with it. Rodney Neff, my uncle and my grandpa's brother. And I believe that my uncle Rodney is my grandpa's younger brother. Now, Rodney, he joined uh, December 12th, 1961 to May, and he served till May 1st, 1984. And he is right up here. The final one that I circled. Now, he has this wine trophy or medal or something that he earned that I just circled and he's holding it. Not sure what he earned it for, but pretty sure he earned it for doing something, right? Because how else are we supposed to earn a medal? How to join. To join the U.S. Air Force, go to the U.S. Air Force website. And go to apply now. You can also drive to um, uh, Stanford uh, Avenue in Majesta, one of the Air Force uh, places where you can apply and join. Now, the picture that I used, not sure if it's the one in Majesta, but all that I know is that it's somewhere where you can go to join. Then, the video that you guys are watching. Goes right here. So, thank you guys for wa watching. If you guys liked it, leave a like, comment, and subscribe if you if you're new. And if you want to, go ahead and like the video and go ahead and uh, leave a comment. Tell me what you thought of it. And if you have any more info on the Air Force that you want to go ahead and leave behind, or if I made any errors, go ahead and fill them in down in the comments. Because that will be a huge help for me.
Thank you guys for watching the video. Love you guys. Peace out. See ya. And hang loose. How do I hang this? Oh, yeah. Okay, sorry, guys. Hang loose.